Hi, this is Maurice Mitchell from the Working Families Party. Just a week ago, I was announced as the new WFP director, and what a week it's been. I'm reaching out because I want to tell you a story about standing up to bullies. Last weekend, the New York Working Families Party State Committee voted to endorse Cynthia Nixon for governor of New York over powerful and conservative corporate Democrat Andrew Cuomo. What we've seen in the last few days is that when you break with Cuomo, he tries to break you. He threatens, he bullies, he's working overtime to try to cut off funding, not just to the Working Families Party, but to our partners in grassroots community organizations that opposed him. Now, let me tell you why our folks endorsed Cynthia Nixon. She's not just an actress, she's an activist who used her voice to lift up so many of our fights. For years, she's worked hand in hand with grassroots groups, fighting for fair funding of public schools and protesting the unequal funding to schools in black and brown communities. I know this because as an organizer in struggling schools on Long Island, I stood with her. Plus, she pledged not to take a penny in corporate money. On the other hand, Governor Cuomo has led the state like a petty tyrant through fear. He, a Democrat, made sure Republicans stayed in the majority of the state Senate, giving them control over the budget, allowing them to protect wealthy donors, all while preventing schools in low-income districts from getting the same level of funding that wealthy districts get. That especially hurts Black and Latino students. If you want to know more about Andrew Cuomo, look at the company he keeps, the people that helped him raise $31 million, mostly big donors, CEOs, hedge fund managers, and the super rich. Despite the giant cash advantage from his friends, he's so vindictive he's going after community groups and the WFP, threatening labor unions to cut their support, all because we dare disobey him. This is not a game. He's willing to cripple the organizations that are on the front lines, fighting for the issues he claims he cares about, simply because he can. There's only one way to stand up to a bully, and that's by holding your ground and fighting like hell. That's why we're asking everybody to step up. If Andrew Cuomo is pressuring unions to end their funding, and he and others like him need to hear a loud and unmistakable clap back in the form of small dollar grassroots donations from across the country. I'm asking all our supporters to sign up to give an emergency donation to the Working Families Party and another to the Community Defense Fund, set up to support community organizations who are at risk of losing funding. Thanks so much for listening. Cuomo says get back, we say fight back.